the future to come in 20 to 30 years? Can it be predicted in the times of global uncertainty? How to map out the contours of the future so that they are more clear and bright? And what can be done by those who are today called the next generation? In today's program, Karakat who conquered Europe. I was calm before the performance because I knew that entire Kazakhstan supports me. My homeland, my loved ones inspired me. This is not only my victory, this is a victory for the whole of Kazakhstan. Bashanova is 12 years old. She's a sixth grade student at the Kulash Baisitova Republican Music School. She's the second place winner at the Junior Eurovision 2020 International Contest. Karakat got numerous awards at children's vocal competitions in Kazakhstan. I was born in 2008 in the village named after Iskulov, which is part of the city of Talgar. There are four people in our family. I live with my mother and two sisters. Mom always supports me. She says to me, to make your future bright, study well and work hard. When something doesn't work out and I start crying, she encourages me, saying that only the weak cry. Dad died when I was seven years old. He was very kind and tried to do everything to make us happy. I remember how I was waiting for him in the evenings from work. He always told fairy tales before going to bed. Dad was very little by my side, but he made a very big contribution to my life. I think it was my father who opened this wonderful world of music to me. Mom wanted me to go to music school. I passed the exams, but they accepted me on the condition that I would start studying as soon as there was a free seat. By the way, an applicant must be able to play musical instrument during the exam, but I didn't know how to play. I entered thanks to a perfect pitch. When I entered school, I studied the most difficult class, the violin class, and moreover in the Russian language. That time I only spoke Kazakh. Now I'm very glad that I study in the violin class. I really like a by song, The meaning and melody are very consonant in it. 
In general, I think when the music and lyrics are in harmony, the song is much easier to perform. I sing the song with pleasure. I love my school very much. We're like one family. When one of us takes part in a competition, everyone supports him, cheers for him as a loved one. My elder sister, Kuralai, is a musician. She always looks for the information about various children's vocal competitions, where I can participate. Then we rehearse together at home, prepare. It was my sister who encouraged me to participate in the Voice of Children 2008 competition. There I sang Celine Dion's song, The Power of Love. At this competition, I became a finalist. For me, it was the first performance of such a serious scale in a good competitive school, thanks to this experience at the Bakhatabala contest, which was curated by Dimash Kudaybergen in 2019, I quite confidently sang Whitney Houston's song, I Have Nothing. Also, I sang the Kazakh Terme Zhekildek at the Bakhtabala 2019 contest and eventually won the third place. I gain experience with each competition. For example, before I was afraid to go on stage, I was ashamed to give interviews. Now I'm speaking confidently. I don't get tired of filming a lot and learn to be active. Junior Eurovision is my first international competition. In general, there was an interesting story. First, my sister saw a post on Instagram about upcoming Junior Eurovision 2020 contest. We did not pay special attention to this information. The fact is that in 2018, I took part in the national selection of Junior Eurovision and that I did not qualify for the final. When I took part in the Bakhat Dabala, I met Raushan, the sister of Dimashko Daibirgen, and so she advised me to once again participate in Junior Eurovision 2020 and record a song for this competition that I like myself. My sister and I prepared the song Stone Cold, sent an application and passed the selection. Later, I won the national selection. Composer Hamid Shangaliv asked who I wanted to devote my performance to when I would sing at Junior Eurovision 2020. At first, I was afraid to speak, but then I gathered my courage and confessed my innermost desire. As a result, Mr. Shangaliv wrote a song that I dedicated to my father. Composer Hamid Shangaliv asked me what dress I wanted to wear for the competition. I said white. Stylist Anarbek Shardemov did not know about this conversation, but he chose a white dress, considering that the image of an angel would suit me. The dress was sewn from 200-meter fabric and weighed 20 kilograms. 
I couldn't change my location. I stood at a certain place, and there they put the dress of my dreams on me. The main thing for me was not the victory. I just wanted to take the opportunity for the whole world to hear this song that I would sing in honor of my dad. Of course, I was afraid, I was nervous, because this song is very emotional. While preparing for the show, rehearsals went from dawn to dusk, and the shooting of the performance took a lot of time. The bad thing was that Junior Eurovision 2020 was held online. It was impossible to feel the atmosphere of the competition. We did not go to Poland, and each performed in his own country. That was a little sad. We, the members, wanted to see each other and make friends, hope to meet everyone at the next Junior Eurovision competition, 2021. For me, the fact that I took second place in Europe is a great success. But this is not only my victory, this is a victory for the whole of Kazakhstan. To be honest, I like the participants from all countries. They have very strong vocals and songs with modern sound. There were songs that really touched my heart. My elder sister dreamt of seeing me at the New Year's concert, and this dream has come true. I was invited to the New Year's program, where I met many of our stars. I don't consider myself a celebrity, but I try to work hard to glorify my country. I don't want to imitate anyone. I want to be unique. I listen to a lot of singers. Of course, I like Dimashko Debergenov in opera singer Zarina Altenbaeva. Among foreign performers, I like Beyonce, Celine Dion, and Tina Carroll. My sisters presented me an easel and I paint a lot now. Back in 2018, parents of the participants in the Balada Osa competition presented me a national musical instrument. Now I'd like to play and sing. I love mountains. The mountains have a special energy. For example, sometimes in your life you need to focus on something serious, but nothing comes to mind. You go to the mountains, and they give you an impulse of inspiration, help you think. So the mountains have some kind of powerful energy. I dream a lot. One of my dreams is to perform the soundtrack to the Disney cartoon. One must work and work calmly for the future to be close and clear. Everything comes in due time. Young Kazakh singer Karakat Bashanova is already making plans for the future. 
After graduation from the music schools, she wants to enter one of the most prestigious conservatories in Europe and study there. In 10 years, she dreams of performing at the world's best concert venues.